art out of the objects that have brought us comfort during our time in quarantine. So what does comfort look like? What does it sound like? What does it feel like? What does it smell like? For me, some of the objects that have brought me comfort have been having yummy meals, going on nature walks and picking flowers, and taking time to write and draw in my journal. Let's transform these everyday objects into art pieces that can show just how they've brought us comfort during this time. I'm going to start with this bowl and spoon. So I've had lots of really yummy meals in this bowl um, and used this spoon to eat those meals. But now I want to think about how I can really show how this has been a, a source of comfort. And so what that looks like to me is comfort is being wrapped up. Comfort is being warm. It's having soft things. So I'm going to see what does it look like when I take this and I put a soft squishy, warm and cozy scarf inside of my bowl. And now it's just sort of a whole new sculpture, a whole new object. My journal has been a really great place for me to reflect, to just sort of check in with myself through drawings and some of my own little reflections. So maybe I can show the ways that it's been so comforting and how it's helped me to feel cozy. So I'm going to just draw this little person. He's sort of just, maybe they're just taking a nap here. And my journal then becomes a little tent where this person is taking a little nap. Last but not least, these beautiful flowers I've been finding around my neighborhood have really been a nice way for me to be in nature on my short little neighborhood walks during this time. And so I could think about adding some drawings to this too, but the other thing that's so great about these flowers is that these beautiful red petals are also a really great drawing tool. So what if I were to create a little painting to show how much love these flowers have been giving me. So what if I make little heart shapes kind of coming out? Or keep using these petals to draw some little hearts. And just show those little heart kind of fluttering off. There are so many ways to transform your everyday objects into artwork. Keep experimenting. See if you can find new ways of showing how these objects bring you comfort. I can't wait to see what you'll make.